You know, NASA plans to put astronauts back on the moon by 2024, but you can actually get there next spring. Sean Gigi tells us that one small North Texas town plans to help you set foot on the lunar surface. Ever since newer and nicer facilities were built, these old athletic fields in Jacksboro have been in a permanent off season. Overgrown and broken for nearly a decade, city officials had no idea what to do with all this land until a company came forward with a suggestion that was out of left field. We kind of thought it was a crazy idea, but we've, we've grown, grown into it and really recognized it as something positive. Like Neil Armstrong 51 years ago, visitors to this old ball field will soon be able to walk on the moon. That's one small step for man. The company, called Back to Space, plans to build a 25,000 square foot map of the moon right here. We're trying to inspire people and educate them at the same time. It's called the Lunar Landscape, and CEO Michael Gordon says it will be the biggest map on Earth. There will be more technology here than on the rocket that launched us to the moon. Michael says state-of-the-art virtual and augmented reality will make visitors feel like they're actually on the lunar surface. So you can walk out on this concrete slab, then explore the Apollo 11 landing site, or get a selfie with Neil Armstrong or Buzz Aldrin if you want. But why are they building it out here? We'll have rocket competitions where people will launch rockets over here and try landing them over there on the same spot where Neil Armstrong and nearly a dozen other astronauts once landed. You can't do that in the city because you have air traffic. Michael says the entire purpose of building this place is because too many people have lost interest in space. Oh, it's beautiful, Mike, it really is. He says we accomplished more during the Apollo program than in the entire history of mankind. He believes if this can inspire a child to reach for the stars or to chart a brighter course for our future, it will all be worth it. If we can get that one person to stand up and say, I went there and it inspired me, wow. That'll give me an extra 10 years of life, that's for sure. <laughs> because someday, someone will walk on Mars. And it might just be because the dream was launched here in Jacksboro. I'm Sean Giggy. Okay, so this is pretty exciting. They plan to break, break ground in August, so just next month. And they do, again, hope to have people there by the spring. They say that every living Apollo astronaut will be there for the opening. So pretty cool. Thanks to Sean for that.